Hey everyone, my name is Tasia. Welcome back to my channel and to another sneak peek video. I, um, just a little disclaimer, you guys know, if you've been watching my videos for like the past, I don't know, it seems like a month, um, I've been dealing with this really strange cough and I finally figured out that if I talk in like a really mellow, uh, voice, it doesn't come bother me. As soon as I get all hyped up and start talking loud, that's when it comes. So, this video is going to be kind of ASMR-y. <laughs> it's not even a word, but you know what I mean, right? So, anyways, let's get started. For those of you who don't know, I do a um, subscription service. We actually have two subscriptions. We have a monthly subscription, and then we have a mystery subscription. This is the monthly subscription, um, and basically what it is is every month you get a pack of stickers sent to you themed for that month. Um, we always send them two months in advance, so this February kit is going to be shipping by December 5th. Um, that way you get it with more than enough time. <laughs> I'm gonna cough through this video, I'm so sorry you guys. But you get it more than in, in more than enough time to decorate your planner. Enrollment um, for the subscription is open from the 20th to the end of each month, and then after the initial purchase, you'll be billed on the first of every month. You're always, you have the ability to skip, cancel, or edit your subscriptions as long as you do it before the 29th of the month. Um, that way, I mean, once the charges are rendered, it's all rendered, but you always have time prior to the first. Um, and then free shipping is world, or free shipping is worldwide. <laughs> free, the shipping is free worldwide. And I think that is all of the details. If I forgot anything, which I'm sure I did, I'm a total scatterbrain today, um, definitely you can reach out to us via email, support at sweetkawaiidesign.com. You can leave a comment in the um, comments below and I will help you out. Um, but without further ado, let's get started. So there are three different sizes when it comes to the subscription kit. There's horizontal, there's vertical, and there's itty bitty. If you go with vertical or horizontal, you get a monthly overview pack of stickers as well. Um, if you go with itty bitty, you're just getting the monthly stickers. So these would work really well in the weekly spreads, not the monthly overview. Although you could use it in the overview if you wanted. Um, the price definitely reflects that, that you're not getting the monthly overview with the itty bitty, but just something to be aware of. Some of the perks, of doing this subscription is that one, it's automatically sent to you. Um, two, you get free shipping. Three would be you get the bottom washi strips, which aren't included in the kits if you do it in the shop. And then you get a cute little die cut as well. Um, so this is the die cut for February. It's George and he's Cupid. I just think that's so adorable. For the monthly kits, I know Valentine's Day is in February and yada yada, but I really feel like the only holidays that you can decorate all month long are Halloween and Christmas. After that, I like to have touches of the holiday, maybe a small theme going on, but for the most part, it's not full lovey-dovey because I don't need lovey-dovey all month long. <laughs> and I'm sure you guys are the same. So actually, let's do the monthly overview first. So. It's really pretty. There are hints of pink in there, of course, but I mixed it in with some more neutral colors and some green. So it's a little more floral, a little fun, a nice break from the winter. I know it's still gonna be full-blown winter in February, but our planners can be kind of fun and bright. So you have your top banners, and I put the days of the week separately, so you can put those. So if you need to trim your trim it to make it fit or anything like that, you have that option to do that. And then you have some bill do stickers as well as some headers. The past couple months, the headers weren't there and I was doing my planner and I missed them. <laughs> so I brought them back. Um, I'm always making changes to these kits. I love to hear your feedback, what's working, what's not working. Um, always just be a little tactful because I have feelings, <laughs> but I like to know those types of things. So that's page number one. 
Page number two, you have your sidebar. And I brought the headers back because I like to put the headers on the sidebar or I like to put the headers on the days of the week um, that are like from January, say, you know, it has leftover January or the March in there. I'll put the header over that and I'll use it. I'll turn it into a functional box. So we have that. We have some quarter boxes. We have your date covers and then even the icons I've been trying to switch up. So I put this little guy in there for like if you had a medical appointment or something like that. And this little pencil I just thought was adorable for documenting. I don't know, like a little embellishment, something important. Um, maybe you're mailing out some happy mail or some bills or you're receiving something. I thought that would be fun as well. So those are the changes. And then page number three, you have your wacky holidays and then your full boxes. I put little opaque covers on the full boxes so that way they're really functional and you can still write on top of them. Um, but if you don't, they're still really cute and decorative. So that is the monthly overview. I'm sorry if I sound so monotone in my head. I'm just like, eh, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> I am not used to talking like this. Oh, so. Next up, we have the vertical kit. Um, you have your wacky holidays. All of the icons in all three sizes are itty bitty. I think itty bitty icons work great in all planners and it leaves a little bit of space for you to write. So that's page number one. Page number two, you have a full sheet of headers with that really pretty design. I do some, or not design, but color scheme. I have the to-dos here and then you have blank headers, which are really nice for like filling in gaps or just putting whatever you want on there really. Page number three, you have four weeks of menu planning, or not menu planning, that's what I use it for, um, but blank weekly schedules. And then you have some more that are similar to the blank weekly schedules, but it doesn't have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and so on. It's just blank, so that way you could use it as a weekly schedule if you wanted, but if you wanted to just make it a generic list or something like that, you could. Next up, you have your bill due icons and your TV icons. Page number four, you have a bunch of flags. So you have three rows of the full size um, checklists and then you have a row of mini checklists there on the bottom. Page number five, I did a full sheet of half boxes. These have been really requested to do more half boxes and quarter boxes. I think they're really uh, universal because even in a full box space, you could put maybe like a half box and a quarter box and a header or something like that. And it just kind of breaks up what's going on. You could put two things in there and they would be segregated and kind of easier to, to see. So that's page number five. Page number six, you have some really nice full boxes. I made some that are really functional and then some that are more decorative. You have your Hello February and some cute quotes and your half boxes. Page number seven, you have a bunch of icons. So you have your payday, your bill dues, <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> you have some celebrating type stickers there and then you might recognize these guys from the perfect match sheet or even the anniversary um, plan with me set because they're just cute little things that go really good together like bread and butter, or paper and pencil, cookie and milk, and then coffee and donuts, and then some quarter boxes. And then page number eight, you have your weekend banners, your blank habit trackers, and a bunch of quarter boxes. I tried to fit on as many quarter boxes as I could. So that's that. Page number nine, you have a full sheet of those really fun decorative full boxes. I think these are really pretty for days that maybe you don't have as much going on or you wanna layer it or something like that. I think that's really pretty. So these are like a faux glitter and you have your floral and then that really pretty striped one. The date covers, you'll definitely wanna use these for February because there's only 28 days in February and that reflects that is reflected in this set. Um, so just keep that in mind if you're thinking about using this for a different month. Um, plan out those date covers. So we have the date covers and then the little dates you can put on the sticker. And then you have your bonus sheets of your bottom washi so you have enough to do for four weeks. So that is the vertical kit. The um, horizontal kit is almost identical. The only difference is the size of the full boxes. The full boxes, they're still an inch and a half wide, but for vertical, 
they're 1.9 inches tall versus the horizontal is 1.63 inches tall. So I'll flip through it really quick and then we'll move on to the itty bitty kit. So again, you get the same exact stickers just sized to fit the Erin Condren horizontal planner. That's what it's modeled after. But I see girls use this in all kinds of planners. You're not limited to just those. Your date covers, the word Wednesday, like that cover is a little longer because it's longer in the planner, the word Wednesday. So you'll notice that's a difference as well. And then your bottom covers. And then for the itty bitty February, let's just swap these out. Again, the icons, they're the same size. What you're gonna see a lot of, oops, I'm out of order here. Um, differences is in the headers and the full boxes and the half boxes. Those all have really big um, differences. So you'll see there, these are just an inch wide while these are an inch and a half wide. And then when it comes to the full boxes, these are 1.2 inches tall and an inch wide. These are 1.9 inches tall and an inch and a half wide. So you can tell that's a really big difference. And the check flags as well. The sheets are configured a little differently so you'll notice they don't sync up like they do um, for the mystery kits. Um, so we have this full boxes and you have your weekend banners and then your icons. The weekend banners are sized down as well. You have some of those icons. They're just all mixed in there to make them fit. You get the same stickers. They're just planned out a little differently. So you have your date covers and then your icons. And then you get a, all of the washi is on one sheet. And that, my friends, is are the subscriptions. <laughs> I hope I don't sound too blue. I'm trying to keep my voice so mellow so I don't cough. And I pause in weird spots. So if you guys are like, she is acting strange, it is because of that. <laughs> if you have any remedies for cough, so definitely let me know. We have concluded that it is allergies, um, but I don't know. I am not concluded on that. <laughs> the doctor is, but I still don't, I'm not feeling it. So anyways, that is it. I hope you guys enjoy the design for February. Again, signups are gonna be open through the end of the month. Um, and then after that, they close down and they make room for the mystery subscription signups. Uh, so yeah, until next time, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.